Guys, here we are. Open the day of bow season. We're in the new blind we just built. Pretty sweet. Um, got my black on, so I blend in a little bit. But uh, we're after the big nine or the big eleven. They've been coming out in this food plot we're on. So uh, they've been coming around around seven ish. Uh, about two days ago they came out. We didn't check yesterday. We didn't want to bugger them up. So hopefully we can we can get one down. That'd be awesome. So. We'll see what we can do.
Alright, Cookie, give us an update. Update. It's October 5th. And, uh, we're sitting in the box. Box we just got all set up. It's 4.30 in the afternoon. I had a couple of shooters all around here the past two days. Hal just hadn't been able to get an opportunity at them. They've been too far. Come out in a different spot. So, we got me and Hal in here today. I'm going to try and get a shot at one and hopefully... The other one comes out and he's a little stupid and <laughs> how can get a shot at the other one, so. Yeah, we got both the bows out here just in case something happens, but today's cookie shooting. I got to hunt opening day and the next day after that he was working, so he's got a lot of time this week to hunt, so we got got eyes on the two main shooters, the 11 on Saturday and the big nine yesterday. I actually had the big 11 right here at about 75 yards. But uh, he's pretty smart, so we're going to have to help some more. I've got a better win today. So, we'll see what happens. Hopefully we can get it done. A little warm in here, isn't it? Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's hot. close as we can pretty much get other yes. than other than just flat out missing or flat well, out killing them. yeah third day of season saturday afternoon had the 11 pointer 75 yards sunday afternoon had the nine pointer at about 200 yards now it's monday afternoon and what happened cookie uh had a bunch of deer come out um not quite where we wanted them to be and uh started coming out from behind us a little bit, probably 70, 80 yards, and I don't know, maybe about 10 deer come out. Nice, some nice bucks. Just not really what we were looking for, keeping our eye on them. And the last five minutes of shooting light, we were just kind of scanning the field. It was getting pretty dark, and uh, <clears throat> the 11 pointer jumps, jumps right out the fence, and he's 40 yards, um, broadside in a blind spot, or blind pretty much and uh, try to get set up on him. Um, as we were trying to get set up on him, he turned quarter away and started slowly walking away and didn't have enough camera light for, to even get that on camera. All we got was us falling around uh, trying to get the yeah. squeaky window open that we got to yeah, fix. Yeah, we got to fix that window and um, didn't bust him out. Uh, Probably, but then the nine pointer yeah, came out. After yeah, that. nine pointer came out right after that. Like eighty yards, and when they were kind of walking together, just seeing those two deer together, is yeah, pretty crazy. That's what I. They're giants. Yeah. <laughs> Leaf for Virginia. Yeah, they are. yeah, big, big Virginia deer. So hopefully, uh, hopefully soon, we're closer than we were, but still not there still, yet. Still not there yet. So yeah, hopefully, hopefully, we, hopefully we can get it done. I'm gonna go back tomorrow. You got a lot of hunting to do this week. Yeah, I'm, I can hunt tomorrow, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Um, Hopefully I'll be back this weekend. Yeah. I, I don't think I'm going to hunt in the morning. Um, probably get in in the blind again about the same time I did today and self-film. and Hopefully. Definitely keep an eye out that back window now because yeah, yeah. <laughs> every day we set up for the food plot and they come out behind we're, us in the, we're in the wrong pretty much last now. place we thought they were going to come. So. Well. We'll keep y'all updated. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully we get them. I really hope. Hopefully, so. we got to end into the story. <laughs> yeah. we've already got a heck of a story going. Gosh, <laughs> we've been we've been watching this deer all summer. All summer. I mean, months, months. We've been watching these two. Now he's just teasing us. And they haven't they haven't really been together. They were together at first, and then they kind of split apart for a while, and 
I guess we're back together. Now we're back together again. So I don't know. Hopefully we can get it done. I think we'll get it done. <laughs> I think we'll get it done. I think, I think we'll get it done. <laughs> Y'all stay tuned. We'll stay see you soon. <laughs> October 10th, <clears throat> it's 3.40, I got in here early, it's raining today, um, I haven't been in here for a couple days, just trying to keep the pressure off of them, um, we, they're still around, um, every picture we've gotten has been, since the last time we hunted, has been dark, um, so I hope we didn't push them to go nocturnal. Um, hopefully uh, this rain will get them moving a little bit um, earlier trying to come in here and feed it's been raining for um, this is day two now so we'll see what happens I'm kind of set up the same way I was last time so y'all stay tuned stay updated I really hope I can get uh, get one on the ground for you here so
Hold on guys, let me get my composure here. Unfortunately, I didn't get it on video. Last minute hunt. The big 11 is finally down though. The day before Thanksgiving. I'm sitting here. I don't know if you can see it. That's my house. My sister just got engaged a couple days ago and uh, she, her and her fiance were up there taking pictures with Tyler's sister. And uh, I was sitting in the blind cause I missed the 11 pointer yesterday morning. I don't know how I did that, but I missed him. And uh, I came up, walked back over towards the house cause we've seen him in here before. Sit down on the ground, not thinking I'm gonna see anything. Dad's running around, looks like the cattle got out. I'm sitting here, sorry, I can't hear anything. I gotta do something about my hearing protection, but I'm sitting here and I did a little grunting, not really expecting to see anything. Sure enough, he's bedded in this ditch, 50 yards from me, I guess, but it's just been one of those seasons. I'm just glad to finally get him. I wish I could have gotten it on video, but it just happened too fast. I can see him laying right there. I called Tyler, I haven't even told him what deer it is. It's just, I better text him and tell him. I mean, I don't even know, I mean, that deer has been the deer that we've hunted all season. We've missed him, we've wounded him. I mean, it's just a story that I'll never forget. Not the best story, but a story nonetheless, but we'll go recover them in a minute. Thank y'all for sticking with us. It's been a hell of a season. Wouldn't want to have it any other way, so y'all stay tuned for the recovery. <laughs> well, the good thing is, Julia was taking her engagement pictures of Bryce and Taylor, and the cow got over now about the field. Yeah. I ran over the hill in the tractor. Like, Hold that. Oh, shit. We're going to be in the turn. <laughs> and I see how Jerry's recording. The field going. A little tight on you? It's still a little tight on you. <laughs> Let's walk up here. <laughs> Tell me what you guys say, good. Update. Update. Number 45 this year. Now come on. Huh? There's a big buck down. Tell him, tell him, Junior, what is it? Tell I ain't telling him, no, I ain't telling him because you, you got to be surprised. <laughs> See no white. You can barely see any white right above those yellow leaves. Oh yeah, yeah. I see them. <laughs> Dang, that's crazy. Oh man, oh, man. Oh, my. He's running all over this farm, and I end up killing him 50 yards from the house. I haven't even touched him yet. Yeah, he's right here. <laughs> you still videoing? Yeah. Well, that's an end of a story right there. What you think? <laughs> that thing. It came right up out of there. Dude, look at the bases on that thing. Yeah. Thank you, buddy. Man, that's one heck of a story. 
so much. I, I don't know. We'll have to see. Yeah, Alright guys, I'm sitting here editing the 11 pointer video. Didn't do a very good job of doing an outro on that video. We were pretty uh, pretty overwhelmed with emotions with this deer to say the least. We uh, had a lot of history with him. And once we finally got him on the ground, it, we just kind of had a loss for words. So I figured I'd give a little outro. We were very thankful to be able to get this deer on the ground. Uh, disappointed we didn't get the shot on film, but Y'all know how it goes whenever uh, you got a got a big deer moving away fast, so I had to make the shot. But uh, I figured I would just give y'all an outro and say thank y'all for watching, and uh, we'll catch you on the next one.